So you might be aware that the internet is full with Rick and Morty memes and debate. Um, I normally don't do non-game product reviews, but this is a topic that I think I can comment on, given my own personal background and education. So I think I would like to give you my take on Rick and Morty as a show. All right, so let's discuss science in Rick and Morty first of all. One element that we need to get out of the way is the multiverse and the portal gun and the interdimensional travel and all these things. I think we can all agree that these belongs to speculative science and not so much to actual science content in the show. So that said, we have in fact a lot of scientific content in the show, so scientific topics that are portrayed in uh, certain ways uh, during all the episodes. And those actually uh, can be sort of looked at from a scientific point of view and trying to analyze whether they're actually correct or not. And I have to say that to maybe the dismay of some of the fans, uh, most of them are actually pretty inaccurate. Uh, if you were to think of a good way to portray them to the general public, they're, those are probably not very good as sort of outreach to the non-scientific community. But the whole thing, you know, uh, the fact that there's interstellar travel, that there's uh, quantum mechanics and Schrodinger's cat as usual being displayed and so on, um, it's actually irrelevant to the discussion. Um, I don't think it plays a role in making the show any worse or any better. So what makes Rick and Morty a great sci-fi comedy show in my opinion then? Well, first of all, the science content of it a bit more or less accurate, more or less speculative, is never the point of the show. You will never find an episode whose focus is the science or the scientific um, element in the in the episode. So using scientific hot topics such as alien life, bioengineering, genetics, um, the heart problem of consciousness, uh, artificial intelligence, and so on, I think it provides a frame for the human drama and the comedy to develop. And so I think it's a, a great opportunity that the writers take to elaborate on the philosophical and ethical ambiguities that derive from, from all these uh, sort of technological and scientific frontiers that um, are currently being investigated. Now, my personal response to internet memes and debates that are going on at the moment. I would say that if you're familiar with the scientific background of many of these issues, or if you're familiar with the philosophical questions that the writers are sort of hinting towards, your viewing experience can be enhanced. I would say so. I'd say that because myself, I've been interested in many of these topics, uh, watching Rick and Morty was an enjoyable experience that was definitely improved by having thought of those things before. But by no means, those things are prerequisite. In fact, I know a great deal of people who love the show and got what I think is the actual content of the show out of it without any pre previous knowledge of, of those topics. So in conclusion, I think having a show that takes interesting scientific ideas, philosophical questions, ethical ambiguities, existential issues, and so on, and uh, that portrays them in this sort of surreal, ridiculous way uh, and uh, has a sort of human drama background is a great thing. I mean, this day and age, I mean, those, those things do not appear easily. They're not uh, mainstream in, in, a, in the current media environment. So I think we should all be grateful that the show is being aired and, and, and getting popular at all. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and leave a comment down below suggesting any further topics or games that you would like to see covered in the future. Also, if you're interested in knowing more about the philosophy behind online gaming, the basis for our critique, and how we do analysis of games, make sure to follow these links that take you to the presentation videos of the channel. Thank you very much, and as always, may your gaming be enlightened.